I'm grotesquely annoyed with YouTube right now. I'm hoping this works because if it doesn't, I'm going to be absolutely disappointed. I have tried to upload the same video three or four times and it says that it can't upload or it says it's processing or it says that it's out to dinner or something stupid like that. So I'm sorry that it's taken me forever to put up an episode. It's already Wednesday. I broke my promise. I said Tuesdays. Um, my announcement was going to be that I'm going to start doing Young and the Restless commentaries along with um, Days. So, my episodes will include both, and I'm going to start airing it at 7 p.m. my time, Central. So, you know, keep up with that, and, um, you know, I, I think that it's time that I kind of reached out and, and did that. So, that's what I'm going to do, and I hope you guys are excited about it, because I will be as blunt about Young and the Restless as I am days. So, next week is when that will happen, and I don't have any spoilers or thoughts this week, because I haven't really had time to sit down and... And study it and everything. And my mom is a huge Young and the Restless fan, so she's gonna keep me up to date and everything. Um, I'd have her do it, but she's so busy, she doesn't have time. Uh, I want to talk more Days fans about what's been going on and more in depth about that. Um, you know, I've always said that I'm not at all a um, Rafe fan at all, and I'll tell you why. In you know Morse code that um, I just never thought that I saw a deep dynamic with Sammy. I just never did. And I have respect for other, you know, fan bases. If you're a Lumi, if you're a Safe, if you're an Eric Cole, if you're an Ejol, if you're Danifer, if you're Dan Lowy, if you're this, if you're that, you know, I respect that. That's what you like. That's what you want to. It's your prerogative. You do your thing. And I have respect for that. So don't think that I'm, I hate you or I don't want to be friends with you because of it. You know, I'd really like to have... An open discussion with a bunch of you but so many of you are scared I'm gonna kill you with my words and I'm not going to that's not the case at all that's very unprofessional of me if I did that so um, basically you know the dynamic that he had with Carrie gave me some hope that I might actually like this character and then he went back to being a smug pig with Sammy and I didn't like it I didn't like the dynamic on either side of the fence I didn't like her acting with him I just you know I Allison is such a, you know, talented person in every aspect of life. And when she plays next to Gallon, it's just, it's dead. It's a, oh my God, it's flatline. There's nothing there. And that's just my opinion. I'm not saying it's fact, but I think it's a pretty, you know, heavy opinion. And I think it's pretty heavy with facts. But that's just my opinion. Um, but I'm really liking the dynamic that Gallon is having with Lauren. Um, the acting is great, and I'm liking this different side of him where he's this chauvinist pig and he doesn't want to talk about feelings, but then all of a sudden the feelings, you know, start coming around, and I'll say that, spoiler-wise, that's what's, that's what's going on, is it's looking like some feelings are going to come into play, and, um, I I'm really liking it. I have to say, I really enjoy their scenes. I will go on YouTube and look them up specifically just to watch their scenes. I really like Briston. I think Elaine is fabulous. I'm so glad that she has gone and visited um, <clears throat> Young and the Restless again because Ashley and Kristen are such diverse characters and she plays them so well. She's one of the most talented actresses on Soap today. You know, I, I absolutely love her and I enjoy her thoroughly. So, um, you know, that's great. Um, of course, I love you, Jamie. You can't go wrong. Can't wait to see what they do with that pairing. Um, you know, I'm. This is another spoiler alert, so turn it down if you don't want to hear it, um, or fast forward. But um, Chloe and Nancy are leaving days, or leaving Salem, um, mid-April. So I don't know what they're going to do with Danifer. I'm sorry, Danifer fans. I don't know what they're going to do with them. But um, I don't see. I've thought about it. I I just don't know. But you know, the Nick thing with Will and Gabby and Sonny is just such a hot mess. And I hate the way that Nick is dealing with Will and manipulating Gabby. And I don't like Gabby anyway. I don't like any Hernandez. I just, I liked Ariana though, you know. But um, I'm ready to see somebody take Nick down. I'm not enjoying the way that he manipulates every situation he's in. He's a smug, arrogant, belligerent, self-righteous bastard. I do not like him. Nor will I ever 
like him. And I don't think you're supposed to. So, um, be sure to subscribe to my channel. Uh, we just need more subscribers. And follow me on Twitter at 3B underscore Queen. And if you want to follow me here, subscribe to me here. It's Courtney space Trip TV. Trip and TV are one. You know, so look me up or whatever. Um, if for some reason that you get sidetracked and you can't um, do it right this second. Which I don't see why you couldn't. But, anyways, see me next week. And I will be doing... Um, like I said, Young and the Restless and Days. So be prepared for that. I'm going to probably go to bed now. It's midnight. I'm really tired, but I didn't want to disappoint you guys. I'm really sorry. So I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching my video because you're just awesome like that. Bye.